Newcastle yesterday. As we get underway, you're going to notice some fun here with this Queen Bee and Kangaroos jersey because the numbers are white on white on the back. We're going to have some fun with that, but let's see how we go uh, with this one this afternoon. As I can reach forward a little bit further on the tackle. The hooker tried to sneak forward himself. Captain coach Goral, but he found an option, and it looks like we got the first try for the game in the first minute of the game. The Aroha. Back to Ayers. What's that, the fourth time he's been involved in this set? He's still going and still bustling and hustling towards the line. He's called held five metres out. Last tackle. Oh, nobody in a dummy half. That could have been catastrophic. I think he's got the ball down there. I thought it went down for Goral. Touch judge has given the referee the nod and said, yes, he has. Now he goes... For Greenwood. Greenwood finds support, starting to pinball around here now. It's back with Thorley. Thorley charges himself. He's taken one with him. He's got the ball down, has he? I think that's a try. A lot of time to get up and play, so it might be hurt there. Wiley runs in over the line. Oh, don't tell me he scored a try. Chris just throws it out wide, and he's got it onto the very athletic jet Simkin, and Simkin has scored in the corner. Today, like today, Brent Crisp with yet another high ball. Oh, he's made a complete hash of that. Oh, that's terrible. That is terrible defence. And Brian Cronin just comes in, picks up the crumbs, and says, "Thank you, mother, for the rabbits." Scores. Okay, Dumas. He gives it out to find Chris. Chris could go himself. He gets to the line. Can he get the ball down? I think he might have placed it down. Indeed, he has. Across to the right. Lewis. Oh, little party trip. Gets it back to Jesse Dent and Dent. Flops over the line. Four points up. They're starting to try the party trick stuff now. Aiden Woods. Oh, geez. Is he covered in spiders or something? Nobody's laid a hand on him from about 30 metres out. That, and I may have said this about one of the earlier tries this afternoon, but that is about an e as easy a rugby league try as you will ever see. That was McGeary. No, it's actually uh, Kylie in the bottom of that. Comes through hands. Now it's with Troy Wiley, and Wiley scores. And he becomes the first double try scorer. We've got Litster there. Litster had to stop and wait. There you go. And number 12 puts a kick through. Oh, my goodness. He put a kick through. Connor Brebner dives on it and scores. There we go. What do the Americans call it in uh, NFL games? Call it garbage time. And, well, look at this. Nobody terribly keen to tackle. And eventually it winds up in the hands of Jesse Dent. He gets his second try for the afternoon. Well, you're carrying a football to do that. Harvey shaped the kick. Underarms at Trevor Chapel style. Into the chest of Chris Thorley. And Thorley makes the last eight metres and gets the ball down. And give it to a bustling Ayers. And Ayers heads for the stripe. I reckon he's got that down underneath the pile there. And I go, I guess from his reaction, he doesn't score too many times to signal the end of the game. You can see the team shaking hands there. There's been a bit of push and shove going on in there. I don't think either of the Sindin players actually made it back on with the conversion pending for that 